We have more snow and wind in the forecast. Meteorologist Megan Chatta takes a walk into history to find another similar February winter storm. Winter returns to Kelloland in the form of a blizzard as we will see a lot of snow and wind. The forecast for Sioux Falls is 8 to 14 inches of snow in the next three days. While we haven't had much so far this February, the month is known for heavy snow. Here's a look at February 1969. It was another day of play for school children. Two schools were open throughout the eastern part of the state. A winter storm brought 11 and a half inches of snow February 14th through 16th. On Valentine's Day in 1969, Sioux Falls received 9.8 inches of snow, which set the record for the day. The 15th brought one and a half, and the 16th saw two tenths. During this storm, Sioux Falls went from 18 inches of snow on the ground to 28. Some highways and most side roads were blocked with snowpack. Hazardous driving warnings were issued again, and a special warning put out to sports fans planning to attend basketball or wrestling district tournaments. The first half of February of 1969 was dry, much like this year. As a total, the city received 28 and a half inches of snow. That means the last two weeks of February had 17 inches. A week after the 11 and a half inches, Sioux Falls received nine more inches. The last two days of the month, the remaining eight inches fell. The active weather will continue as there is another system at the end of this month. For Kelloland Weather, I'm meteorologist Megan Chatta. History repeats itself, apparently. Yeah, just when we think we're, you know, getting over it. And we knew it was going to snow. Yeah. We had to. We had, we had a state dart tournament here in town. State dart tournament? Uh, it was a wrestling tournament. State wrestling tournament, right? yeah. Just like in that 69 clip where they mentioned the wrestling yeah. tournament. Yeah.